Hello everybody, how's it going? This is Neo Starling and I just wanted to give a quick tutorial on how you would set up your BitCup once you get your Twitch affiliates approved, which I think is a pretty cool initiative that Twitch took in order to help us smaller streamers out and you know slowly uh build up our following till we get to to the prime where everybody else is at to the motherland anyway um real quickly it's just a quick video to show you how you would do it on Streamlabs specifically there are other places that you can go to set this up but um me personally i use Streamlabs, so that's what i'm going to show you um so all you have to do on your web browser just type Streamlabs. as soon as you go on there you're going to see here on the left hand side you can just scroll to the where it says the jar. And when you click on the jar, you'll get a different selection here with different jar images here. So you can just choose whichever one you like, whichever one I guess best suits your personality. Uh, I personally like this glass over here because I like drinking whiskey on the rocks and this is typically the one that I get when I go to the bar. So you just click on that and um, there's different features here um, that you can customize it any way you want. It doesn't have to be limited to just having the jar. You can set it up uh, you can change like the bit amount that you want displayed, uh, the font size of it, the text color, all, all the goodies that you'd probably know how to do if you set up any alerts here in the past. Um, but basically, once you click on that, what you'd want to do is um, right here where it says widget URL, you just click to show the URL. And then what you're going to do is just uh, copy widget URL. Once you copy it, what you're going to do next is you're just going to go to your OBS and under here where it says sources, you could just right click, add, and you're gonna add a browsing source. Uh, now when you get this browsing source popping up here, I already have one that says Bits Cup, so I'm just gonna click on that one. You can name it whatever you want, but I typically just call it Bit Cup just to keep it simple. Uh, just click okay, and I already have it here. Um, but to show you guys how to do it manually, you could just go to the properties, or where it would pop up if you just make it a brand new source for the first time. And where the URL is, you would just basically delete what URL is there and then just paste a new one. And you can just hit OK. The jar will be there. And you can place it anywhere you'd like on your channel. I typically like having it uh, right here, right above my name. So you'll see the little bits falling in there and whatnot. So that's pretty much how you set it up. So when people end up um, donating bits to you, it'll pop up. The little sound effect will pop up. You can customize it to be any way you want it to be in reality. It doesn't have to be the default setting that it comes with. But anyway, um, I had a lot of trouble looking for this and uh, my good friend with it, Sama, he actually showed me how to do this. So I wanted to share it with all of you guys in case nobody else knows how to do this and you just got affiliate and you were wondering how to, how to do the bit jar. <laughs> so just a, a small little video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you did enjoy it, please like, share, subscribe. Do the damn thing, help a brother out, and that's pretty much it. So with that said, you guys are awesome, and don't ever, ever let anyone tell you different.